This ain't Sam Adams. It's either honeymead or homemade beer. I guess we're doing honeymead. Big shout out to Alicia who got me a new knife sharpener. I got a little one, but every time I use it, I slice my goddamn finger open. Alicia, not Alicia. You already had your own video. Is that pizza ones? So don't get a big dick. I don't know why there's three. I don't understand. I I don't know. I don't understand this. It probably had instructions, but I threw that shit away. Whatever. Is that sharp? Oh god, yeah. So on today's episode, I'm going to do something a little different. If y'all have been watching my shit for a while, you know that 98.6% of the stuff that I do is pork. We're not going to do that today. We are going to do apples. We're going to cut them up and put them in pork. So here's my little trusty thing with Jigger that I can never get to work right. Son of a bitch. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I got five of these. Uh, I don't even know what these are. Granny Green, Smith. Green ass apples. Granny Smith. Granny. Granny Smith apples. That's disgusting. Don't forget to peel them too. Peel them? Yeah, you need to peel them. Why? So they'll cook properly. So they won't get a yeast infection like yep. Granny? Oh! Alright, so apparently we're peeling them first. We! Peel them first, peel them afterwards. No. It, you know how hard it is to hold a wedge and peel it? I just tried it. It sucks. Okay. You can eat 14 bags of rat poo. Yep. Uh, like that, just do it all around. Whatever, who cares? All right, once you got your apples and shit peeled off, spray yourself a little pan, or you don't need to, because I just came up with a different thing, but you need a pan, you need your apples. Now, I would normally just use straight up brown sugar and a lot of it but we're making this vegan friendly so wait what are we doing diabetic mm -hmm. the fucking difference <laughs> we're gonna use this cocoa nut uh, palmetto bug sugar <laughs> so you're gonna put as however much you feel is gonna be necessary it's hard as tits look at that stuff mmm mmm We're also going to have the diabetic add the brown sugar, so if she dies, it's her fault. And this is on video. <laughs> you, you're going to die. So that's all you need. You'll want to cook it just long enough for the butter to melt and you'll want to stir it up really, really good and drain it if need be. <laughs> I thought I was done. No, you need some sin in them. Holy shit. <laughs> ah! Look at that. Look at it. <laughs> oh. Son, chop! Hell yeah. Alright, now here's where it's going to get all surgical. What you're going to try to do is cut a U or a V shape, or if you're really feeling kind of spry, you can cut a W. So I will show you how to do that now. You want to leave the ends alone. 
do not cut the ends so here I go here I go here I go again on my own going down the only road I've ever known salt and pepper uh, push it push it real good pushy pushy galore a lot of vagina pushy didn't I already do a Sean Connery episode? Yes. Fuck him for dying. Uh. Eh. Eh. I don't even know how deep I'm supposed to go. No. Oh. oh. That was why you're sharpening the knife at the beginning of this video because you need a sh kind of a sharp knife to do this. I wish I had a freaking scalpel but you know I'm not that smart. You probably can't hear me anyway because I probably like sped this up. Spetsnaz. Okay that just ain't deep enough so I'm going in a little more. Okay, once you get your uh, latrine dug out, you take your back thing that you cut off, you're going to try to make it into a, a kind of like a cap, so you're going to cut the, the thing off. is taking so long now you'll want to keep your spare pieces so I'll make doggy treats out of that so ain't gonna come out perfect but there's the back thing and it doesn't fit but it's okay because we're gonna tie it up and we're gonna put the apples in there then we're gonna put this over it we'll show you what to do all right get yourself a big ass pan give it a fair spray with some fruit release you can go light, because we're actually putting parchment paper on it this time. I love parchment paper. You can write shit on it, or you can cook. Son of a bitch. Alright, see, so lay out some twines. I gotta, got them a couple inches apart, because we're going to tie this bastard. So, you take your loin, and you put... Then you take your cap off. Okay, abort, abort. Take your rub off. Oh my god. Abandon these things for a second. Put your rub back in. We need a rub. So I got butt rub. I got brown sugar McCormick's bourbon season McCormick's grill mate McCormick's I got some coming I don't know why I like this stuff but I do a little bit not a whole lot I got some garlic powder I got some new salt and pepper in my old salt and pepper shaker so I don't have to go I don't have to be careful anymore Not too much. Hang on. Ladies and gentlemen, this is about to get dumb. Put a lid on it. Give it a good shake. Shake it. Shake it up, baby. Now shake it up, baby. Twist up. So. So. Bam. Rub. It's going to go on your meat. First, you're going to take your cap off. You're going to flip this bastard over. Oh, come on, man. Come on. Oh, yeah. You rubbed it. Massage it. Look at that shit. Oh. 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 What? Don't try to avoid the 
where the potatoes are going to go, or the mashed potatoes. What am I? What are we putting in here? Apple. Holy crap, dude! You want to get that rub all over it, everywhere, inside. Even inside. Even inside. Okay. I guess we're going in. Oh my god, look at it. Oh, oh. oh. I need to do that fucking. Oh. 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 oh my goodness. Oh, where's your little. Here's the bowl, the string, and here's the little nuggets I made. I'll get those too. Hang on. We ain't done, folks. Black, black, yeah, 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 oh, yeah. Oh, okay. They ain't got to be perfect, cause that's actually dog treats. Who cares? Now you got your shit all thinged up. Now you can just put it back on the thing. All right, we're almost done. Take your flap out, and Goiter's gonna put her apples stuff in there and hope it doesn't overflow we did drain it but we saved the juice so save your damn juice oh look at that oh, oh. all right apparently we overdid it on the apples so now you're gonna put your veg piece back on top and see how it's overflowing that's okay we're gonna try to tie it all together and make it work Oh, I can't do this with a glove. I just wasted a glove. I don't care. We have a box of 610. Oh, Lordy. Lord have mercy. Oh. Uh, this is what I call the dwarven hitch. I'll show you here in a second. Didn't really get a, give a good look. The dwarven hitch. All right. You need to piss off gonna go over once over twice pull it taut like a virgin twat and like a square knot you'll go left over right it's stuck it ain't going anywhere and I'm gonna tie a longitudinal one right over left right over left or left over right I don't know what the hell I'm doing Left over right or whatever the opposite was. Count. Ow! Stepped on my tits. That is the apple stuff that we drain. So save your apple juice or whatever the hell it is. So you're gonna drizzle that up. Oh my god. I say we just eat it as is. I ain't got time for that cooking crap. No, there's still some left. Mmm. Apple drizzle. Drizzle. Is it dinner? Is it a dessert? Yeah. You got the oven turned on to 325. 325? We're gonna go for how uh, what? 30 minutes? Well check we'll, out 40 minutes. We'll check we'll check out at it at we'll put we'll get it. Wow! Woo! 325. We are going to put it in there for probably 40 minutes. We're going to check it at 20, bitches. Oh, one last thing. Here is a, here's your dog treats. Just set them to the side. It'll be all right. Didn't we have a bunch of apples taken out? We had some, yes. All right. I'm going to put those in there, too. Oh. Just drizzle them up. There's 20 minutes. We're going to go let it go another 20. Oh, look at it. Mm. <laughs> I think it came. <laughs> That's 40 minutes. I have no idea how to serve this. There's the spare apples. There's the dog treats. Oh, yeah. We're going to put it in our mouth somehow. I just cut it open and it is all kinds of pink. 
we got this from a smoking thing, but we don't have a smoker, so we're having to oven it. So we're going to put it back in. We're going to up the temperature to 375 for another 20 minutes, and we'll check it then. Bitch! And there it is after another half hour at 375. I think it's time to put it in our damn mouths. I don't know about you, but I'm, eat, I'm, I'm done cooking. Screw this cooking. I'm done. Mouth! Now!